It's me, Tammy, and I'm here with a Valentine's Day look. Um, I know I don't usually keep up too well with these looks, but I just decided to give it a try. Um, and I decided to do something different, and um, yeah, um, I didn't go soft, but I didn't go extremely smoky, and I focused more on a duochrome color, so the color kind of changes, so I feel like it goes with a lot of outfits. And then I did use pink, but I actually used a bright pink. Um, yeah. So if you guys want to see how to get this look, keep on watching. So you're going to begin by applying a primer, and I'm using Urban Decay Primer Potion. And just a little tip, guys. If you ever use a primer and feel like it doesn't really work, um, try giving it a little time to dry after you apply it. Sometimes that's all it takes. Sometimes you apply it, you apply makeup on top of the moist uh, primer and it's just not really gonna stay as long because it hasn't had time to set. So we are going to apply NYX Yogurt and it's a jumbo eyeshadow pencil. We're going to apply this all over our lid. And we're just going to blend that out a little bit. Okay, now we are going to apply some Black Rose Mineral Eyeshadows. And the color I am going to use as my lip color is going to be Minky. And I adore this color. It's great. It's, um, it's like a, a dual chrome color. It's so cool. Because in some lights it looks gray and some it looks blue. Um, it's just really fun to work with. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to dip my 217 eyeshadow brush in here. Tap off the excess, and I'm going to apply that all over my lid, and just pat it on. And now just blend out what you have. This is so cool, because in certain lights you just, it just looks different colors. Like right now to me it looks kind of purplish up there. Now, what we're going to do to make things pop a bit, because I like pop, um, is we're going to use another mineral eyeshadow, and it is from Black Rose again, and the color is Hello Kitty. And I'm just going to use this Revlon brush, and I'm going to dip it in here, tap off the excess. That's a lot. <laughs> and I'm going to actually dampen it with my MAC Studio Fix Plus. I want it to be even more bold than it already is. And I'm just going to put this in the outer and inner corners. And just blending into the crease. And just a little bit in the inner corner here. Okay, now to intensify things a little bit, we're just going to use a black color, or like a brownish color. And the color I am going to use is from Wet n Wild, and it is their crease color from Silent Treatment. And I'm just going to use a 217 again. And I'm just going to put that directly in the crease, nowhere else. Next, we're going to take this brow bone color from Silent Treatment and put that on our brow bone. And eye pencil. 
to Tight Line, and this is from L'Oreal, and it's Leaner Intense. It is their liquid pencil eyeliner. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean up the corners because I went, I colored outside of the lines, guys. Sometimes I do that just in, in an effort to blend things out. Sometimes you just kind of get out there. So I'm just going to use some, a Q-tip if I can get this bag open. Okay, I'm going to use this Q-tip and it has a pointy corner, which is what I'm going to use. I'm just spraying a little Fix Plus on it. I know some people lick it. I'm not gonna lick it. Starting on the inner corner and just pull up. See, it has a nice sharper look. Okay. Next, I'm going to apply some liquid eyeliner and this is L'Oreal Liquid Intense. And I'm going to flick it out at the end here. Okay, next we are going to curl our lashes. Apply some mascara. I'm using CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion in Very Black. Okay, now be sure to dust off any of the uh, powder you may have gotten on your face. Now it's time for some blush. I'm going to use my blush by Benefit and it is in Coralista. Gonna apply a highlight too because um, it just looks prettier. And the highlight I'm gonna use is Shell Pearl by Mac. I know a lot of people like to highlight like down the middle of their nose and center of their face and all that. Um, no, I usually just do my cheekbones. So on to lipstick, I am going to use, I'm going to use Nearly There by Maybelline. It's just a nude color. But I love these because they're lipsticks, but they feel super, super moisturizing. I mean, really moisturizing, not like, I don't know. People always say that, and then when I buy it, I'm like, it's not feel moisturizing at all. This feels like a tinted lip balm to me. These are the, uh, what is it? Oh, Color Sensational line. Really, really good. So I'm just going to leave it like that. Some people might put lip gloss on, but mm, I don't need to. Um, and if you want, if you really want to amp this up, you can put some falsies on, but I'm probably just going to take a nap after this, so no need to waste some falsies. That's all for now, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked it.